Well, today myself uh, and Leanne were here to put a number of points to the Parades Commission in regard to the Bally McConley uh, parade that has been applied for uh, in the village of Rishargan. Uh, the band have applied to bring 44 uh, bands uh, through this small, uh, mainly nationalist village. So we are strongly putting the point to the Commission uh, that there needs to be restrictions in terms of loyalist bands, the size of the parade, uh, and we need a better outcome uh, than residents in Rishargan have faced uh, in recent years. There are many restrictions put on um, the people in the village of Rishargan annually as a result of this parade. Many of the bands come and bring with them loyalist paraphernalia, which in the 21st century really isn't on. Many people in Rishargan were the victims of loyalist paramilitaries and it's just something that we cannot longer, no longer accept. People in Rishargan have been coming to the Parades Commission for over 10 years now to make representation to try and ensure that this parade does not cause damage to community relations uh, and does not pose a significant threat to people living in the village. What we need now from the Parades Commission is something that's going to guarantee a better uh, outcome uh, for residents. The band have refused to engage with residents for the past 10 years, so that is why we need a, a better, uh, a tougher decision from the Parades Commission uh, to ensure that the band will engage with residents and we come to, come to an outcome uh, that uh, suits uh, the residents of the village uh, and ensures the residents have a proper say uh, and parades are held uh, in the village.